The FAA is investigating after a Boeing 737 MAX 8 jet made an emergency landing in Florida while on its way to storage. This comes when airline safety is taking center stage on Capitol Hill today. 2 News' Kelly King has the details in this developing story. This is the same plane that's been grounded after two deadly crashes. Tuesday, Southwest says pilots aboard the flight reported an engine problem shortly after takeoff. No passengers were on board at the time. The airline says the plane was heading from Orlando to California for storage. The crew was able to safely land back at the Orlando airport. Now, we don't know if Tuesday's emergency landing was related to recent issues involving 737 MAX jets. The global fleet of these planes have been grounded indefinitely since March 13th after two fatal crashes. The FAA confirms Boeing submitted a preliminary software upgrade back on January 21st, but the FAA hadn't yet approved it when an Ethiopian airliner crashed in March. Meanwhile, the NTSB chairman and FAA chief expected to face a grilling on Capitol Hill today. Boeing is a, is a, a world-class company. They are one of the finest companies in the world. And uh, we are confident that Boeing will find a solution. The FAA will testify that changes need to happen to overseeing aviation safety. However, according to a prepared statement, the FAA will defend its original decision not to ground the 737s after the first deadly crash. Kelly King, to News Today, working for you.